Hey everyone, Jordan from VSI here. Hey, we wanted to do a video for you guys today because we've been hearing a lot, especially from our newer liquid users, that they're scared to use liquid when it's super cold out. So it's a cold January day here in Minnesota. Uh, it's negative 10 right now. It's gonna be like negative 18 tonight. Uh, the wind chill is gonna be, it was negative 35 this morning. It's gonna be like negative 40 tonight. So it's very cold. Um, not the wind chill affects your de-icing, but it's, it's very cold here. Uh, I wanted to make it well known that the colder it is, uh, the easier liquid can actually work. And the reason for that is because there's so little moisture content in the snow when it's this cold. So we're gonna spray this lot uh, with our VSI uh, 305 Legacy Sprayer here. We're gonna put down 80 gallons an acre. Uh, it's a 90-10 blend of 90% uh, salt brine, 10% Headwaters Hot Additive. And I think you'll see with this dry snow, we have a little bit of drift over here from after we scraped this morning because of the wind. Um, I think you'll see it's gonna take care of it pretty quickly. So let's get spraying. All right, so it's now negative 13. It's windy, it's cold. This spot had drifted over pretty bad, so we sprayed about a half inch of snow. So it's real slushy, but as you can see, it's not slippery, good traction. Um, full sloppy, but you know, spots that had less snow are nice and clear, dry, safe, no ice. It's gonna be negative, uh, negative 18, 17, 18 tonight what they're saying so we'll come back tomorrow and show you that this still isn't frozen the spots that didn't drift over basically look perfect i mean they're little streaks of snow yet but no ice here it's all good pavement so back here we had less drifting obviously so that helps give us more the results we would typically Yet on a freshly plowed lot, unfortunately the plowing we did last night drifted over by the time we got here for a video. So, see a little bit up by the garage doors there for drifting, but otherwise this all cleared off pretty nice. Good pavement. So for those of you worried about using liquid in sub-zero temperatures, you really don't need to worry about that. In fact, in this situation, I can just about guarantee you that liquid is going to work better than any granular product you can use, and that includes treated salt. The reason is because there was almost no moisture on the surface when we applied to it, and you actually need that moisture to activate the product. You can see, obviously, like I mentioned, we have some slush because there was some drifting. Typically, we would have plowed that. We sprayed over it just to prove the point that even with that much snow, this cold of conditions, again, being around negative 12, negative 13 right now, negative 16 to 18 overnight, all we have left to slush here, the parts behind me that did not drift over, they're starting to dry already, and by morning they'll be completely dry. We'll follow up in the morning with some pictures and show you what it looks like. 